teacher Phil Scavo, commonly known as Captain America, gained the nickname from the 8th graders of Novi Middle School back in 2012. They thought I looked like Captain America. So they said, oh, you, Mr. Scavo, you look like Captain America. And I was like, oh, that's so nice of you. The next day they showed up with the shield, that shield up there. And uh, that's how the whole thing started. And I was like, oh, this is really cool, you know. They call me worse things. The next year I moved to the high school and so did they, because they were going to be freshmen. And then I was moving up here. And so the name, it followed. Because of his resemblance to Captain America, Scavo had the opportunity to attend the Civil War premiere in a custom-made suit. My, my cousin is the Baltimore Sun Insider, so she works for the Baltimore Sun Times and she does like all their Entertainment Insider stuff. So she came for a visit, she heard the story, and she was like, oh, you should do a premiere, I should have you do a premiere, and we talked about it for, for a year or so, and then uh, they were going to have me do it for Age of Ultron, but that didn't work out, so then Civil War came around, and she had been talking with all her contacts at Marvel and showing the pictures of me, and they are like, oh my gosh, this dude looks just like him. We got him, he needs a suit. So they had me send all my measurements and then Marvel actually made it for me. So like other people that got one for premieres, it's not made to them, but mine's made specifically for me. The premiere was awesome. Like if I could get paid to do that all the time, that would be cool. So it was basically just me and a guy doing Iron Man, basically screwing around with fans for two hours. So they had us get there. We got into the suits. And then they had us, they had like a whole like uh, meet and greet station set up and we took all kinds of pictures and then the coolest thing was there was all these little kids and some of them were like dead on convinced that we were the real people, like it was us. So that was kind of neat. And then we just messed around the whole time and pretended like we were fighting over snacks, things like that. The guy playing Iron Man um, and I would keep messing with each other. They had all these promotional materials and some of them were like towels. They were about this big. And some said Team Cap, some said Team Iron Man. And so I, every time they'd take a picture, it was the same photographer, and I figured out her rhythm. And so every time someone would hold up a Team Iron Man one right before she'd take the picture, I'd put the shield in front of it to cover it up. And so we had like a little like fake rivalry going. And so one time, uh, a fan wanted just a picture with me, no Iron Man in it. And so playing on the fake rivalry, he pretended to get all angry and then like walked off our little thing and like, I'm gonna get snacks. And then like took popcorn out of a guy's bin as he was walking over and everyone was stopped what they were doing and we were watching him just like playing out the most amazing fake, like angry moment. Devin Simpson, Cat's Eye News.